looking pretty good. Oh, I told you to at five. <laughs> don't don't listen to these proper talk addies. <laughs> See, that was the adrenaline see, though. Over, overruled me and it all went terribly wrong. That was, that was, uh, that was the adrenaline. So guys, we are down here in the Pro-Am at the HSBC Abu Dhabi Championship and I'm playing in the Pro-Am with Danny Willett, Masters Champ. We've played six holes so far. This is the seventh hole. So we're going to play all 18. We'll get some footage on video. Uh, we've got Pete caddying and has done a stellar job so far. I, I would say an unbelievably good job if I'm and, honest. And that time, it's 197 tap flag that we've just seen. And I had five iron in my hand. And Jonathan went, that's Danny's caddy. He said, no, hit four. That's what I did. What could I add? What could I add? The bag. You had it ready. It's got a non-con right four with four iron in it. <laughs> 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 you didn't realise you had a cannon of a four iron, did you? I feel like you'd be all right mid-stance. Yeah. Moving it out of that left-hand side, eh? Back a bit. Nice. Excellent. Oh, yeah. Great, shot. Great shot. Tax six these two. Do you know what I think? I think that was we hit five, you hit the wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hit five? Deliberately, <laughs> deliberately trying to ruin Did you hit five in the end? <laughs> <laughs> In fairness, he's using you. I don't mind. Because yesterday we hit five iron in that front trap because the wind was stronger, so he. Yeah, no, hey, good on you. Early in the use, morning. Early in the morning. Look good, of course you have. <laughs> so we are playing at Abu Dhabi Golf Course, which is absolutely stunning. Uh, I've actually played not too bad for six holes there, Pete, would you say? Well, I've been actually pleasantly surprised. I've not had to shout at you once yet. Pete's been getting me some good yardages. The only thing that I've been... I didn't want to turn the camera on too early and jinx myself, but I've probably, I've probably missed all the good shots now. You're going to see... Do you want me to be down the green? Yeah, well actually, yeah. You get me a bottle of water, mate? Um, where I'm going, you might not want the liquid. Oh, wow. Um, so the format in this event, it's a bit like the Turkish Airlines open format, where I think it's an American Texas scramble or something like that, where we basically choose, or American scramble, we choose the best tee shot, and then we play our normal balls from there. So my ball counts, I've played off the same tee as Danny, the championship tee. So Danny's hit one into the green there. So I'll actually be putting from his ball. Um, just you know what? He's a top top guy. I really enjoyed his company so far. Uh, I mean, I'm learning a lot about the grain. That's something I'm really learning a lot about at the moment. And let's uh, let's see if I can hold our birdie putt after Danny's not on the green. So we're down by the green. We're playing off the through the year. Just to give you an idea, right? At the moment, you can't see my ball. I'll probably just see the top of it. That's how thick the rough is. Oh, that would be an awful look. Oh God, that would be the worst chip in the world. But luckily, we're putting from Danny's ball, so happy days. Right then, Jen. Too much grain in this. This will be in at the left. <coughs> Can't obviously touch the green, that would be illegal. Definitely not got it on video. Actually, strangely enough, yeah, slightly. Slightly in at the left. Great. I'm trying to turn here. Come on, Rick, you've gone third now, so you know the line, you know the pace. <laughs> Go. Hit that, you hit that, you kind of start, you pushed it from left edge to straight, but then because it got further right here, that went right now. Jonathan? It's unlucky, mate. So you did a good putt then? Yeah, we've just been having a pretty in depth discussion about grain. Oh, it's fascinating. Look at that, he's pushed that right here, yeah, we can see that. 
I only thought grain was just yeah. made so bread, but too far right, it does affect cutting as well. I feel like I'm giving no <laughs> Well, I tried to. I think you confused everyone even more. <laughs> Daddy was saying left there. I pushed it right and it moved to the left and missed left. Well, it's crazy because when you look at this grain, there's no way it looks like it moves to the left. I probably just drew it. <laughs> so for birdie. I've been putting great so far, biggest separation, would you say? Can you see between? Oh yeah, 100%, and the wedge play, wedge play is amazing. Wedge play and pulling has just been unreal. We'll see on some drives, hopefully. I mean, literally, it's my Sunday best head for a tee shot. And we're only on a Wednesday. A bit of Go! Oh. Oh. I baffled him. You know baffled everyone. I think we're all still baffled. <laughs> um, like an episode of Mastermind or something. So what we're going to do in this video, we're going to try and do, we'll do seven, eight, nine on this part, and then we'll crack on to about nine. What am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> There you go, Pete. You know, I think this this could be a winning formula. This you keep saying this, and it's just not the case. I'm not being funny, mate, but I've not I've not had more than a par yet. Because par, par's the worst score yeah, you can get. That's true. Yeah, that's <laughs> very true. <laughs> so it's like I've had one birdie. Um, so, all pals. I'll tell you what the most impressive thing is, Danny's three under with his own ball, not playing great. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> is that right? Is that that's, true? Yeah, that's, I think that's the big separation, it's just all three amazing Oh, he has actually, yeah, that would have gone to four under, wouldn't it? Hit a couple of great shots and it's just like, it's easy, it's, yeah, it's good. Education. We'll keep the, ca we'll keep the camera rolling, whoa, hello. Eighth hole. <laughs> hello. Hello, eighth hole. Par five. 600 yards into a slight breeze. We've got this. We've got this. Since what all the progress did, my shadow. Six hundred yards this so. all. Almost go flood light right flood light. Lovely. Very, very nice. <laughs> wow. Awesome shot. No, very good. Okay. Now you're on camera, let's squeeze out that extra 10%. <laughs> Everything on it. That flight would have looked awesome. Good There you go. Alright, well, nice. go. go on, go! <laughs> Not a chance there on that flight. Go! Until it landed. <laughs> I don't care. If <laughs> 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 I keep up with him, I'm happy. <laughs> so, I'm not going to lie to you. When I was saying before, that was my Sunday best. That was my Sunday best. It's only seven yards. And Danny does his Sunday, my Sunday best. Every single t shot. Draw against Fade. Fade wins. Fade wins. I thought I sliced mine. I will know say. So let's say we're all going to hit from Danny's ball. Well, I don't know. You could probably get key since semi. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh hello. Yeah. See that bad ball. Yeah, because I can place it, can't I? Let's see if Danny hits it here. So there's a par five here. Still got oh, quite five. a distance in. Because when you lay up on it, you either lay up like 125, don't you? Exactly, yeah. What we got in there? 
So we've got 306, we're just trying to fly it on that left track. I think it feels like 50 yards. We'll start it on that, on that scoreboard. Try and trying it, finish it right off that left track. <coughs> it's actually fair way, isn't it? Yeah, so actually, yeah, if you hit it straight, then you're yeah. alright. So, left scoreboard. Slightly off to the left hand side, but you say we're going to do it. Yeah, well, out of that would very good. Do they? Yeah, it's okay. Though. I thought we got it. Oh no, I think we got an awful long way. Open out, yeah, over that bunker will be okay. Yeah, that's good. Open out of that. I think it's like 290. 290. Yeah, these are known as proper par fives, aren't they? Yeah, very much so. Striker, that one. Go on, come back. Oh. Just spun up a little bit, didn't it? Just That's probably ambitious bit. there, Pete. You know what? It's what marks you out against the competition. Ambition. <laughs> probably ambitious trying to get no. on the green from there. No layups. I think that was a, that was a silly. No layups A silly one there. <laughs> Eric's just finished up in the right hand rough. Took a lob wedge over. I think he's gonna wait. Yeah, thumbs up, thumbs up. Green light, it's a green light shot. Yeah, he's gotta come over a massive bunker here, relatively tight pin. It's very good from that. Very good, chap. Ricky performing today. Little tip of the cap. Very, very impressive. Nice shot there, Rick. That's right. It's not that I think Belong. Belong out here. We have Belong out on the on the championship fairways. Well, rough, but. I was on the fairway. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Well, I never. If it isn't Max Cashmore, <laughs> he's grown 16 foot. That's ridiculous. I think he's only 13 now. Nice shot. Yeah, very good. In out your left, not much. What's, what are you looking at? In, are you looking at the hole? More at the hole. I'll watch about there. Can see how, how sharp it is there. Keep coming back on. Well, up and over the fence, down we come. Navigated everything. Nice shot. Well Very good. It's still going, Frank. Awesome.
easy to go further side, you can see more than directly over it. There's not loads, in fairness. A lot less on this one than there was on the other one. Yeah, it's been a bit of a education for me and Rickless about grain. Just off the left. Yeah, so then this, if there was no grain, you'd probably go half a ball left with the grain. You'd probably go ball, ball and half. Ball. you got a good two, two balls movement, two and a half balls of movement. So as long as you don't go more than two and a half balls outside, with perfect patience will catch the edge. Got it? Good, birdie. Very good. Helps when you can read them. Alright, we are going to do a lot, especially on greeny greens. Mm. Maybe now different it is when. I would have read, read that very differently. Yeah, cool. very different. I don't think you need me anymore, mate. Just, just, just stay Danny around with. Just stay Danny around with you. <laughs> Again, driving's been awesome today. Very, very good. I if I got it down, but fair way. Uh, join your club, which one? My back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, cutting is interesting. Yeah, I'm not, not quite used to this, to be honest. So many responsibilities. Good as well. I'm driving very, very well. Have you edited it enough now? Oh, this is a lovely experience. Wandering down the manicured fairways on the night hole here at Abu Dhabi with the Falcon in the background and two golf balls primed. Question is, in who, the middle of the fairway, who is going to win this particular battle? Because they were well, both little fakes. So, no way. They so, were both little so fakes. far, I think Danny's had me every time, bar one. I've had him once. On oh, like the second half. Yeah. Sprinkler head. I mean, it's 70 past him, granted, but it's. <laughs> <laughs> We've walked down. Danny's striding down there. I'm acting cool at the moment. You know, I'm not getting, I'm not getting too crazy. I wouldn't have you. Evidence was suggesting that. That's going to get too cool. I ain't, uh, I ain't that alright. A little bit bottomy. Oh my god. What does it take? What does it take? And now, I absolutely, I'm not in it any better than that. So, you know what I was saying before? It's my Sunday best every time. It's my Sunday best and more. I'm not hitting it any better than that. I'm going to start hooking it again. I'm going to start drawing it. I think you should do. I think you should get away from your news. No, the fade's good. Yeah, working the fade. I'm in the fairways. So again, we're dropping it down next to Danny's ball. Just seeing a cool little feature there. The green, si green 16. The end and the Z have rubbed out a little bit now, eh? Are they Just Nick wife and Zach, and wife and little. And I had a D on there as well, but my ball looked a bit messy. <laughs> Too many. How far have we got? 156 all in, so playing 60, 60. Five? No, nowhere near that much. Straight, straight left. Fraction 
and then stack. Strike again. Right. Off side, feed around a wee bit. Steady. Yeah. Go with eight as well, right? Yeah. Go with eight. Actually, not not done this time. Yeah, go with eight. Uh, just aim. Go for a one and a half yard fade, just off the left. Let it feed round, A time. Commit. <laughs> mm, I haven't touched it either, really, with the wind. Perfect. Yeah, that's pretty good. Good shot. I'm happy with it, well done. Nice to get inside of that. Nice to be in, to be fair. Oh, great looking shot here as well. Get it, go on, go on. Oh, go on, get around. Great shot, there we go. Awesome go. shot. Keep them rigging. Look at this as well. Good bounce. Good bounce. Oh, unlucky. Unlucky. Okay, Ricky, get on that green. Oh, hit it. Hit it. I just got a slightly different angle of these puts. And down the background. That oh, doesn't look too bad, does it? See you later, Mikey. There's like half an on-course lesson on grain reading, green reading this. Certainly worry what the match is going to be like once Rick gets the end of it. Pushy. Steady par. I do on this. Yeah. I think I would have got it. It's just getting a bit really bad to make him make him bird if he's catching him up, you know what I mean? One round. Oh. oh. That was very, very close. <laughs> so I think that's. Right, guys, so. We are going to finish part one here. Once this goes straight in the middle of the cup. Yeah, Perfect. Uh, Jordan's on the back now. We're going to get a few more holes when we're out there playing again with Masters Chan. Danny Willett. He's been an awesome guy so far. I've really enjoyed his company, company immensely. You want to go he's he's very good at this. Bit, he's very good at interacting with all of the playing partners, giving them reads, which uh, he doesn't have to do, and it's really nice to see that he does that. Perfect. Good put. So, guys, join us in part two. We shall. 
continue a bit more with Danny Willett. Have you got a score going this front line? Um, You've got a few birdies early on. Yeah, probably three or four, I'd have thought. Made a few birdies. Again, nice. Pardew Friends always a nice one on a prime day. Yeah, it is. Not too much, not, not too much concentration needed when you're not making, when you're not making birdies. <laughs> So we're going to jump out into part two down here at Abu Dhabi Golf Club. Thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed the video, click like, comment below. And I'll see you very soon in part two.